Hey, how's it going guys? Mr. Boss for the win here, and in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video, I'm actually going to be talking to you guys about some of the potential weapons we might be getting on the next generation and PC versions of GTA 5. Now we're going to be looking at weapons that were previously cut from the game, but still have data files and information in the code of GTA 5, and we're also going to be looking at weapons that were supposedly supposed to come out with previous patches. So I want to be talking about a few of them. Some of them are more novelty, some of them are more useful ones that I'll actually be using, but again, some of them are very cool so I made a video like this covering the three vehicles we are going to be getting for next generation and now I want to talk about the weapons as well so I'll include a link in the description but essentially there is a list of weapons that were removed or changed during development and of course they could be released as future DLC or they could come along in the next generation version of the game now I'll do my best to include pictures on the screen but you can also click the link in the description and there's essentially about seven or eight new weapons that were removed right before the start of the game one of them is a shovel another one is a wrench a fire extinguisher a fire axe a rope a scar h which we've seen so far the xm25 airburst grenade launcher which i'm assuming would be a different variant of the grenade launcher we have right now an m14 sniper rifle which is more of an assault sniper rifle and an lmg light machine gun which again is that machine gun image that we've seen uh, with previous patch updates so some other things to note, there was a Zippo lighter in the game as well that was supposed to be usable. Most of the weapons also had a green tent that could be applied to the weapon. Some weapons also had a wooden finished tent, like a wood cast model that you could apply to weapons. And there was also laser sights that were cut right before the game. So a cool attachment that you could potentially add to some of your weapons. So I'm very excited for these. Most of these, in fact, the shovel, the wrench, the fire extinguisher, the fire axe, the rope, and then the SCAR and the LMG light machine gun all have, you know, HUD or HUD icons built into the game of Grand Theft Auto 5, which means they were meant to be in the game, but didn't quite make it past the development phase. So I'm very excited for these. Some of these, like I said, are more novelty, like the shovel, the wrench, the fire extinguisher and the fire axe and the rope. But then there's some that I think are really cool, like the SCAR, the M14 sniper rifle, the airburst grenade launcher, which I'm assuming airburst would be lock on. Please correct me in the comment section down below if that's not right at all. And then again, the LMG light machine gun. So there's about four that I would really end up using. And then there's four that are more novelty and more silly ones that I could see just going on like rampages on. So if I wanted to go on like a pedestrian killing rampage with a shovel or a fire extinguisher, I could as well. So again, really cool things. Hopefully these are some of the weapons we're going to be getting in terms of next generation. If they are, I'll be very pleased with that. A good mix of things that I can kind of laugh at and a good mix of weapons that I'm actually going to see myself using. So again, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Do you think this is a plausible theory to actually getting these weapons or do you think we're never going to see them again? So again, leave a like on the video if you are new and did enjoy this video. Leave a comment letting me know what you think. And of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red button below this video if you are new or you like daily Grand Theft Auto 5 videos like this without the way guys like i said thanks for watching take care and i'll see you guys in the next video